Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you my OBS recording settings that I use so that when I import the video into Resolve, it actually recognizes it. So let's go ahead and get into it. What I'm going to do here is go to the settings just to show you how I have mine set up. And what you see here is the simple mode. I like using this. It's pretty straightforward. So in the recording area here, I have my settings to high quality medium file size. I have my recording format set to MP4. That's the most important thing here. And anytime I use these settings, especially MP4, the rest you can change the quality. I have zero problem importing into Resolve. So people in the past have had problems reporting. Usually it's because they're different codecs like Flash or MKV or something like that. What you're gonna have to do is pretty much do a couple test files to figure out which one works best for you. And I found that MP4 works best for me. And also one thing to note is on your video setting, make sure the output is equal to the, the input or sometimes the uh, quality of the video is not that good. So for this one is 1080p and 1080p. Okay. But most important, uh, the codec right here and then the quality, of course, depending on what quality you want to get. Again, make sure you do some test files. Don't do a 30 minute or a 60 minute test. Just do a one minute, 30 second, whatever until you're getting that video quality that you like and that game capture or screen capture, whatever you're trying to do. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop this and we're gonna import that into Resolve and I'll show you how it works. Okay, now we're in Resolve. Let's go ahead and import that media file that we recorded with OBS. We'll go to File, we'll go to Import, we'll go to Media, and I believe it's this one right here. We'll go ahead and hit Open. And depending on the file itself, the size, your computer processing power, this might take a little bit of time to actually see the, the video itself, but just give it a little bit and then you can actually drag it into the timeline here. And if you have a slower computer or if it's a bigger file, it might take a while until you can see it, but after a while, you will be able to see the file and navigate around in it. Like I said, in OBS, it's all about this setting here with your output and the recording format. I highly recommend you start messing with the MP4, do a couple of short test files, like I said earlier, and then you can mess with the quality, decide if you need higher or lower. You can also go to the advanced settings, but that's on you. But basically, it's all about the, the codec. So you need MP4 or something very common. Sometimes that default recording format just doesn't work with importing into Resolve. So you have to come in here and switch it to MP4. And again, do a quick test one first before you waste an hour or 30 minutes or whatever. And then get it, you know, get it nailed down exactly how you want it. And from then on, you don't have to change it. Alrighty, I want to thank everybody for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, hit the bell, all that jazz. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace and aloha.